This is one of the 900 species of blennies living in the waters of the world. The Bleniformis, or blennies, can be found in rocky pools, sandy beaches, reefs, and beds of kelp. Although they range in size, shape, and colour, they can mainly be identified by their often enlarged eyes and mouth, and their wispy antenna, or appendages, that protrude from their head. Their bodies are often long and sleek, with nearly all members of the Blenny families having a small size. In the wild, Blennies have a diet of mainly small invertebrates, such as shrimp, snails, and tiny fish. Though there are Blennies, such as the lawnmower Blenny, who prefer a herbivorous diet and only eat algae and other such small sea plants. Once a Blenny has reached sexual maturity, it'll try and find a mate. If the male finds a female, the male will then perform a courting ritual. If he managed to impress her, then she will lay her eggs on the surrounding rocks and seaweed for the males to fertilise. The male will then guard these eggs until each of them is hatched, and he will not mate with another female until all the babies have left the nest safely. As soon as baby blennies are born, they must go out onto the reef and fend for themselves. In the wild, blennies have many predators. Lucky for these little guys, they have a clever trick up their sleeve to stop them getting eaten. Camouflage. This blenny lives in the open sandy plains of the reef. So he has an almost see-through body, helping him blend in. Whereas this blenny lives in seaweed beds, so his body is more brown and covered with spines to help him hide from hungry fish. These charming little fish are all around the world, and if you look hard enough, you might find some on your next snorkel. What blennies did you find?